Hello from Google for Nonprofits. This video is a quick tutorial on how to activate Google Ad Grants. The Ad Grants program provides eligible nonprofits with up to $10,000 a month in spend on the Google Ads platform for text-based ads in Google Search. The first step to getting an Ad Grants account is to request a Google for Nonprofits account. If you navigate to google.com slash nonprofits, you can review our eligibility requirements, and when you're ready, request an account. After verification of your nonprofit status, with a Google for Nonprofits account, you can activate and use Google products in the platform. Once you have your Google for Nonprofits account, you can navigate to the Ad Grants card, click through to complete the eligibility form, and submit your activation. Once our team performs a quick review, you can get up and running with Ad Grants. Let's walk through the process. First, log in to your organization's Google for Nonprofits account. You'll see your nonprofit name, under which you can click Activate Products. You'll see a list of all the products available through Google for Nonprofits, including Ad Grants. And if you click Get Started, you'll navigate to the next card, which shows you the details of how to activate Google Ad Grants. If you need more information about the Ad Grants program, if you click this link, it'll take you to the Ad Grants website with a list of the benefits and success stories of previous nonprofits using Ad Grants to do things like recruit volunteers and fundraise to raise awareness for their cause. When you're ready, the first step in activation is to complete the eligibility form. When you click this link, it will open a Google form called the Ad Grants Eligibility Form that'll ask your organization a set of questions, including the website you plan to use for Ad Grants. Finish this form and click Submit, and then go back to the Google Ad Grants page in your Google for Nonprofits account. You've finished that form as step one. Now you need to check the box, letting us know you've completed the form, and click the Activate button. If you've gone through these steps successfully, you'll see an email from Google for Nonprofits in your inbox, letting you know that we're reviewing your activation. During this review process, our team makes sure that you have submitted that eligibility form, and that your organization is planning to use Ad Grants with a secure and high quality website. Once this review is completed, our team will create a Google Ad Grants account for your nonprofit and invite you to the account so you can get started. You'll see this email when you've been approved for Google Ad, Ad Grants with a list of steps that we'll walk through briefly to help you understand how to start using Ad Grants. First, you'll receive a separate email inviting you to your new Ad Grants account. You'll need to click to accept that invitation. You'll also receive an email inviting you to a Google Payments profile. You also need to click to accept that invitation. This is a requirement for account access, but as a nonprofit organization, you will not be charged. So don't worry about that. Once you click through to accept the invitation to your Google Ads account, you'll see a screen that looks a bit like this with the option to get started with a new ads campaign. So this is where you'll want to go to get your organization up and running. If you need some support in getting set up and, and learning a bit more about how to successfully use Ad Grants, visit the Ad Grants Help Center at support.google.com grants. There's a really great step-by-step -step tutorial for how to set up your account, including tips and tricks for nonprofits. There's two common activation challenges that nonprofits might face in this process. The first is if you get an email saying you didn't complete the eligibility form, that might mean that you forgot to go to that Google form or submit it. So log back into Google for Nonprofits, navigate to the Ad Grants card, click to complete that form, make sure you submit that form, and then come on back to the Ad Grants card, click that little button that lets us know you've completed the form, and click Activate. That should solve your problem. You may also get an, an email saying that your website needs some work. To solve, you're going to have to do some work on your nonprofit's website. So make sure that you own the website you're planning to use for ad grants, that it has robust and clear description of your organization, mission, and activities, that it has substantial content, updated events and information, and clear navigation. You'll also want to make sure your website loads quickly, doesn't contain broken links, and is secured with HTTPS. If you need more detail on the Ad Grants website policy, you can navigate to the URL listed here or just visit support.google.com grants and search for website policy in the search bar. When in doubt, visit our help centers 
That top link is the Google for Nonprofits Help Center, and that bottom link is the Google Ad Grants Help Center. Thank you so much for your time. Best of luck getting started with Ad Grants.